Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Rock Lee Smile, and I am here to ask and answer one simple question. WTF is Chapter 3 of McPixel. Holy crap, we're gonna go, and we're gonna take a look. Because that's what we do here. We're gonna go to the bonus round of Chapter 3, and we're gonna grab this ticket on the ground, we're gonna hand it to the conductor, or we're actually just gonna get it sucked right directly into it. Uh, today, Anibumation, I think. Anime, probably? Theme? Probably anime, or cartoons. Okay, looks like Simpsons, probably? Yeah, totally Simpsons. Awesome! Alright, this is... What's under here? Oh, rub the rub- rub the rug. Light your hand on fire. Makes sense. And of course, that introduction is, uh, Total Biscuit. I'm sure you've seen his videos by now. He's only one of the most popular indie game YouTubers around. Made him barf up a bomb there. Not a Total Biscuit, that boar. I actually didn't quite catch what that was supposed to be a parody of, but I was also sort of half paying attention. So clearly Smurf's here, and I think Dexter, Dexter's Lab next, not a... Not the killer from Florida who likes to keep slides of his victims. Uh, slightly different Dexter. Um, freaking Smurf and Smurf. Oh, he turned me into Gargamel. That's a rough thing. You go from being a pretty happy, regular old guy to, um, bald. Not that there's anything wrong with being bald. Just when you're not expecting it, it just hits you out of, like, out of nowhere. Uh, Dee Dee blows our experiments to smithereens. McPixel episodes get me really worked up. I do weird crap like sing and do weird intros. I don't even know where this is coming from, it just happens. Flintstones. So far I'm 0 for 5. <laughs> or 0 for 4, this is 5. Um, Alright, she's got no chin. None of them have chins. I should probably have noticed that by now. Let's uh, go out the window. There's no window. What's she have to say about it? You got nothing to kick down there. How about you? You got nothing to kick down there. Fred's got something, I think. No, Barney's got something. Nobody's got anything. I took too long. I was kicking everybody in their junk. As uh, McPixel is wont to do. That is like his favorite pastime. Oh, it's Goku. What do we have here? Is this the power pole? Um... Budokai Tenkaichi GT Dragon Ball Land. All right, let's take this thing. Power pole extend. That looks risque. Oh, it turned him into a Sailor Moon lady. Oh, <laughs> I don't see the moon. Oh no, I do actually see the moon, but it's a uh, half moon. It's not full. It's supposed to turn red or something. All right, Homer. What's going on out here? Nothing. Nothing. A house from Nuketown. Alright, what's up with these rocks here? What are we looking at? Oh, it's it's like Lion King or something? Yeah, okay. I was just like completely not paying attention at all. I like the kitty. I want to take him. Come on, you're supposed to have balls. Give me the kitty. I'm pretty sure it would take exactly one punch to get the kitty from most guys, or one kick rather. What's in this gift here? Let's unwrap it. Let's give it to, uh, Younger Smurf. Nope. Didn't even get a cha uh, chance to see what happened with that. Oh well. Back to Dexter's lab. Uh, what can I do? Touch some buttons. Kick some DDs. Uh, just kick the bomb. Why not? Dexter, you know you can't fit that in your mouth, even with all the science in the world. Well, maybe if you, like, dislocated your jaw and replaced it with some sort of cybernetic extension. Alright, let's start handing bombs out. Let's start on the right here, work our way left. What's going on with this? It's, like, not even giving me time to see the animation, just, like, done. I'm not too happy about that. I want to see what happens when I give them the bomb. Uh, let's just go... Yeah, let's, let's start a martial arts fight with Goku. Uh-oh. Yeah, Kamehameha, bro. I don't have a middle anymore. That is a goofy-looking monkey. I kind of like it, though. So I have to defeat Goku? And become the champion? What's in the couch couch cushions? Anything? 
Did I try going outside already? No, door is not selectable. Did I try kicking Homer already? He doesn't seem to care. Take the bomb. Uh, take the bomb, give it to Homer. Figured maybe he thinks it's a donut or something. He really likes donuts, I've heard. Oh, he's just gonna blow it up. It's not really how I expected that to go down, actually. That did not seem like a win situation for me. Alright, Timon and Pumbaa, uh, let's try kicking the little guy. Or no, we can't kick him. Let's, uh, give him... Switch him, switch him. Take the... Yeah, take the kitty. Alright, that did not solve a single thing. Things were looking up there for a moment. Um... I've tried kicking both of these guys, I think. I haven't given the present yet to Pop... Oh, I did that already, yeah. Darn. Alright, present next time's going to Papa Smurf. And then maybe I'll see if I can check out the window on the side of their mushroom. Um, I haven't given the potion yet to Dee Dee. Or the, not the potion, it's science stuff. These aren't potions, these are advanced chemical... Oh, that's awful looking. That did not solve our problem either. I probably have to pour that on some machinery or something, or just pour it on the bomb. I'll try that next time. Alright, Flintstone situation. We still got a bomb here. Uh, Fred likes to bowl. Let's give it to Fred. I was gonna work my way over, but this is super lame. It's not even showing me what's happening. It's just insta-fail. So how do I even have a chance against Goku? This guy is like, he's pretty good at martial arts. I mean, I've watched a few episodes. Oh, can I take the moon? Let's take this. Destroy the moon. Because I actually get... Yup. Oh man! Transformation time! And I get to wear a pretty dress. Sailor Mercury, I guess. I don't remember what who is what. Apparently Sailor Moons, Sailor Moonanites, Trump Gokuites. I would have thought only like Piccolo would have had a chance, or maybe Freezer or Cell. Would have been funnier if we turned into them. Um, I haven't taken him yet and given him to his buddy. Kuna Matata, right up your ass. He doesn't seem to mind. Oh no, he does. Just took him a minute for it to kick in. Wow, he worked his way all the way out. Lemmy Wink style. That's an interesting solution. And we did everything in that one, so let's do a little bit of checking out this window. I was going to give the present. Door, nothing on the door. Alright, give the present to Papa Smurf. Oh, just got a bomb. Alright, that's probably a gold medal on that one. Not the most interesting solution. We got a bonus round within a bonus round! We're meta-bonusing! Oh, it's this one again? I've already seen this one. This is like level 1's bonus round. What's going on under there? You got a belly? And I'm dead. Alright, gold medal on three of these so far. I think we're doing pretty good. Uh, let's take the chemical mix here. Make some meth. No. Let's make some bomby explodey. Oh, hulking out. I will force that thing down your throat, Dexter. <laughs> no homo. Uh, yeah, I totally used force on that one. Um, let's grab the bomb. Have I tried putting it out the window already? That seems kind of obvious, actually. It seems too obvious, in fact. Apparently it was just obvious enough. And I'm already on the verge of another bonus round, so if we get really lucky, maybe next time we can hit a second bonus round. Uh, but we are down to exactly one more chapter's bonus round left. Hopefully you guys are still enjoying this series. I should have possibly one, maybe two more episodes, uh, depending on if we want to go back and do the 100% on the other bonus rounds we haven't done yet. Um, I would kind of like to go back and see the rest of those video game levels from the previous episode, because that was super fun. And this one was reasonably fun as well, but I still think Chapter 2 has taken the cake. And actually, the movie references in Chapter 1 are pretty amazing too, so... So far we've gotten movie references, video game references, anime, cartoon references... What in the hell are we gonna see in Chapter 4? Whatever it is, I'm pretty excited about it. I'm, I, I hope you are too. Uh, and I hope that you will come back for what may or may not be the final episode of our Pixel Let's Play. Because I'm still having a great time here. You know, a month after we started it. 
Although there was a bit of a break, because uh, I did all of the episodes of the original Let's Play in one night, and now I'm doing all of these episodes in one sitting as well, so it's going to maybe take a little persuasion to get me to sit back down again and finish up 100%ing everything. Uh, but if there's some DLC, that'll probably bring me back a lot quicker, and I am eager to see what's in the extras menu at the uh, opening outset. So uh, we'll see what happens. Chapter 4, here we come. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night.